you thinking about moving to Trilogy at Vistancia, located in Peoria, Arizona? Well, in today's video, I'm gonna take you on a tour of Trilogy and show you everything it has to offer, show you all the amenities, and then show you a few different properties at different price ranges so you have an idea of what to expect when buying a home in this beautiful community, Trilogy at Vistancia. Now, if you're new to this channel, my name is Brian Fall, and I'm a real estate agent here in the greater Phoenix area. So if you wanna stay up to date on all things Phoenix real estate, uh, community tours and updates for things growing around the Phoenix area, be sure to hit that subscribe button. So we are for location in Northwest Peoria, which is very far Northwest Valley of Phoenix. So Trilogy is a community that's age restricted 55 and older, and it's within the master plan community of Vistancia. So you are probably about 45 minutes to an hour to get to downtown Phoenix to the airport. Right outside the Trilogy at the Stancia community is the Loop 303 freeway. And so you have a uh, kind of quick access to that freeway. Trilogy here is a Shea community. Um, Shea built all these homes here. They're all single story homes, large range of value. And we're from high 400s right now up to a little over a million dollars. So we're starting to tour off right here on the back side of this building here, which is the Kiva Club, which is one of the two clubs they have here in Trilogy. This is gonna be the largest one. This is like the central hub of the community. It's actually a 35,000 square foot club they have there. So this is like your rec center. They have um, a couple of places in there you can eat uh, food uh, from coffee to lunch to dinner. And then there's also a spa where you can get massages or waxes. Um, and then there's also a lot of the recreation style stuff. Your swimming pool, it's indoor as well. They have an outdoor swimming pool, outdoor spa, bocce ball, pickleball, tennis, you name it, it's out here. They got horseshoes uh, just down the road. There's basketball court. So they have all the outdoor amenities you can imagine. Um, but one thing that's real nice about this, they, it seems like they're re they really um, want to embrace that outdoor lifestyle and enjoy the, the weather we have here in Arizona. Um, and you'll see that here outside, there's just a lot of people sitting out. Um, they got the little fire pit going. So it's really got a lot of good social atmosphere. And kind of looking out this way is the backside of, this is the driving range here of this golf course here. Uh, this is a par 72 course, very beautiful course over at the clubhouse they have v's tap room a nice place to grab a bite to eat get some drinks so one thing i really love about trilogy at Bastancia is tree-lined streets i mean there's grass and trees going down as you enter the community that might be weird for some of you but we don't get that in arizona a lot having all that green is really nice as you come into the community you really feel like you're just a step um, above and I, I think that's the idea here at trilogy is that it's a little bit finer living. Um, of course, that comes at a cost. Uh, some of the homes might be more expensive. So I'm um, not to bash on any other uh, retirement communities uh, nearby. A lot of those have a lot to offer as well. But Trilogy, just the architecture and the style. Now it is newer. That could be part of the reason why you know, it looks a little bit nicer. So let's talk cost to live in Trilogy. So like any retirement community, you're gonna have that one-time initial investment, uh, the capital improvement fee. And uh, for a Trilogy, it's uh, $3,360. So at the time you close and are moving to the community, you'll pay that to basically be a member. And then you'll have a reoccurring $840 a quarter HOA fee. And that really covers you uh, using all the rec centers. And then again, they have a lot of maintenance to do. There's so many trees, so much green. So you're paying to have that nice landscape and to utilize the different clubs and rec centers that they have here. So now that we've taken a look at the uh, main Kiva club here, uh, I've gone over some of the amenities they have here, the cost to live in the community. Um, I'm going to take you on a tour of a few different properties so you have an idea of uh, what to expect when buying a home here, uh, what your money gets you. Um, so. Again, the, the, I'm gonna do homes at three different price ranges, kind of the lower end, middle, and then the high end. But you can expect to spend anywhere from high 400s right now. Uh, this is the beginning of 2023. So high 400s all the way up to 1.2, 1.3 million. Again, all that depends on size, location, if you're on the golf course or not. So um, a lot to factor in when it comes to cost there. So let's go ahead and head over to uh, home number one. 
Here's a look at the neighborhood of home number one. Now this home is located just a few blocks away from the Kiva Club, which is the main rec center within the Trilogy community. This property is listed at $500,000. It is 1,656 square feet, two bedrooms, two bathrooms, and it has a den. It was built in 2006. Before we enter the property, you'll see that there's a very nice courtyard sitting area out front. As we enter the home, you'll see on all the windows, the home features nice wooden shutters. In the kitchen, there is quartz countertops, beautiful backsplash, staggered cabinets, and stainless steel appliances. As we get to the master bedroom, in the bathroom there is double sinks, a stand-up shower, and a separate toilet room. Out back there is a very nice covered patio, and then kind of a natural wall with all of the plants surrounding the home. And that is a look at home number one. Here's a look at the neighborhood of home number two. Now this is located in the far north side of Trilogy, very close to the Mida Club, which is one of the two recreation centers located within Trilogy. Now this property is listed at $800,000. It is a 2,744 square foot home featuring three bedrooms and four bathrooms. This home is super cool. It has an attached casita on it with its own entrance. Got a full bathroom. This home was built in 2011. Um, as we walk up to the property, it has a beautiful courtyard with some great brickwork on the outside of the home. Very large living, great room inside the home. Massive kitchen counter and island with granite countertops. The master bathroom features double sinks, a shower with two entrances, and a separate soaking tub. As we get to the back patio, there's an extended covered patio and an extended pergola on top of the patio. There's even a fireplace and a water fountain. Also, you can enjoy the Arizona desert. This one also has a wrought iron view fence open to the desert landscape behind the home. And that is a look at home number two. Here's a look at the neighborhood of home number three. Now this home is extremely close to the Kiba Club, which is the main rec center within Trilogy. This home is walking distance to that, and it also backs up to the golf course. So this property is listed at 1,250,000. There is 2,680 square feet, three bedroom, three bathrooms, and a den. This home was built in 2013. Outside it has a beautiful pavered driveway and entrance. As we enter the home, there is such a large and open feeling with the large windows and sliding door out to the back. This home also off of the living has a courtyard with the fire pit so you can enjoy the Arizona weather and that is covered by a pergola as well. Well, in the kitchen, uh, beautiful granite countertops. There is a kitchen island with the sink at the island, stainless steel appliances, double stacked oven microwave, as well as a beverage refrigerator. And throughout the home, there is tile and hardwood flooring. In the master, you will find a his and hers closet, as well as a separate soaking tub and stand-up shower and double sinks. The backyard features an extended covered patio with a built-in barbecue, travertine tile, and a beautiful pool and spa so you can enjoy the view of the golf course. And that is a look at home number three. All right, so we're wrapping up the Trilogy at Vistancia tour. We are at the Mida Club, which is the smaller of the two clubs that they have here in Trilogy. So this one's on the very north end of the community. Uh, but they still have amenities here as you can see the pool spa behind me uh, tennis a couple of the outdoor activities still a gym and then a uh, kind of a bar and grill um, and then an art studio as well so some different amenities again smaller uh, rec, uh, rec center club here um, on the north side so um, if you have any further questions about trilogy um, feel free to reach out to me um, i'd love to answer any questions you might have um, so if you're looking to move to arizona in one month or one year. Um, I'd love to help you out in any way. So my information will be below and feel free to reach out and thanks for watching.